Plus, we'll set it back to you. Thank you, gentlemen. SIU investigators are charging a Toronto police officer. Constable well, Paul Walker is accused of assault causing bodily harm. It's for an incident that happened on December 13th of last year. That's when 57-year-old Bayashi Yang was arrested and released. He was later treated in hospital for a broken bone in his eye socket. Constable Walker will appear in court July 8th. It comes with a waterfront view, but it is also home to some of the messiest construction in town. And that construction is into its third year. Queens Key has been ripped up and redesigned. Senior News' Natalie Johnson is there. Natalie, what's going on there? But the deadline for this project is looming. It sure is, Ken. The goal has been to wrap up all of this construction in time for the Waterfront Festival and the Pan Am Games. And although you may not know it to look at it right now, Waterfront Toronto officials say this will, in fact, all be cleared up by June 19th. The tourists here to see the waterfront took in the sights and sounds of a construction zone today. A maze of pylons along Queen's Quay, a revitalization project that has meant digging and detours for three years now. A big hassle in a way. Dust. Yeah. No I mean, that has never no. heard of it. But that construction will in fact come to an end in less than a month.